Hello! Welcome back. Um, to me. You know, just sitting here, talking, thinking, dying slowly as the day goes longer. You know, it's, it's been a while since I've done one of these, and for a really good reason. But, hey, guess what? It's therapy recap time. So, <clears throat> I haven't done one in a while because things have been rather... roller coaster ish Very ups and downs, lefts and rights, dark places, bright light. You, you know, you know how those go. And... I was not really in a good place. I thought I was. I really thought I was. Um, but I'm getting back. You know, I was in a relationship for a little while. And I'm not going to say anything negative because it's not who I am. Um, we just had two different styles of what we believed a relationship would be. And I wish her the absolute best. You know, I hope that she can find somebody that gives her everything that she needs um, in her life going forward. I didn't feel like at the time I could post these videos because I didn't want to <sighs> say the feelings that I had out loud and have her upset or anyone else upset for that matter for the things that I were feeling things I was thinking I got to a very very dark place to where I had to get back on my own again yeah it's kind of weird thinking about it how when I'm faced with a situation that I, another person's happiness is kind of dependent upon me, I, I shut down. And I used to shut down, like, really bad, like, horribly bad in most of my relationships um, up to this point. It was like, yes, yes, whatever you want, princess. I'll do whatever you say, and, and I'll do that. But as I've matured... Um, I find that I can't do that anymore. You know, I can't I can't do the whole white knight thing anymore. I can't be there for anyone anymore. And it really got me to a place to where I did not feel good with myself. You know, my mother ended up in the hospital um, she's still there, by the way. So I have the house completely to myself now. Just me and the dogs. And for the first part of that, while well, kind of um, I don't know, still dealing with the, you know, the relationship, I really had very bad thoughts about this is it. Like, like, one more step and I was just... done with... life. Um, I, again, I felt that I couldn't do enough. I couldn't be enough. I couldn't do anything. Um, and I just shouldn't be here anymore. Um, I had to drag myself out of that. I still have a lot of those intrinsic thoughts, but um, talking with my therapist and um, allowing the understanding that I have grown since the person that I once was. Yeah, I stand up for myself now. I don't let myself be easily used. Um, I've in love with just being alone. 
I love having to only worry about my own happiness. And it's the greatest feeling in the world. Like, I don't mind being kind to people and treating people with respect and making sure that they can be happy. But, like, don't... I'm not at a place anymore where I feel like I also do not deserve happiness. So... <clears throat> me and her both agreed that I was not in a place where I could be in a relationship because of that. Which is fine. Again, nothing wrong with her. I'm not saying anything bad about her. She's a very lovely person. I care still about her deeply. Just, we could not mesh well with our ideologies of what we think, what we feel. But I think with that, kids, I am done in the whole relationship field because I find more happiness and quiet just in my own presence, in my own ability to um, be who I need and not have to make sure everyone else around me is taken care of before me. My daughters are different. Like, I love my daughters, and I will do whatever I can to make sure they're okay, but they're not always here. And that's just the way the court system has made it. Um, so I'm getting better. No longer intrinsic thoughts. Just come home. Dog's happy to see me and him play for a little bit and then he gets as close to me as possible when we sleep so but my therapist said he was proud of me I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing but here we are but yeah I am probably happier now, more content than I have been this past couple of months. Alone is good for me. But then there's you. So thank you for being you, for being amazing. Because you are absolutely amazing.